Hey guitar buddies, let's get physical with Olivia Newton John. Where hey? <laughs> Great little sequence there for the verse. Okay, so the chords I'm playing, I've got two guitars there. So um, we've got... So just moving down there, so you can see that. So that's the guitar that was on my looper pedal. So I'm playing open A, E and A. Then a B passing note, so open two two, B on two, then a C power chord, and just muting it slightly. Then a D chord, so five four two. I'm playing that inversion of D. They're just playing E G E. Repeat, and this next time, same, yeah, but after the D, I play a B with a D sharp in the bass, so good. And then I'm playing um, E minor, then just taking my fingers off to get a D with an E in the bass. So just E minor, oh, taking the fingers off, back to E minor, finish back on the D within in the bass. Over that, I've got a second guitar playing. So I'm playing there is a C, an E, and a G on 10, 8, uh, 10, 9, 8, sorry, 10, 9, 8, which makes that first chord an A minor 7 when you put. Okay. So play that. Mm, that. And then I play E, G, and B, which is over that C power chord, which makes that chord a C major seven. And then just a couple of stabs on a D, which plays seven, seven, seven. And then the third time, I'm just playing D sharp, E, F sharp, G, which then that J, G then rings out over the other guitar playing that. So, so D sharp on eight, nine, E on 10, F sharp on seven, G on eight. So, oops. oops. And then the other guitars playing that. So a uh, great combination of two guitars working together. And just before you go into the chorus, all you do is there's a slight change in that uh, we've got. We go to an, an E major. So instead of gives it that little lift into the chorus. Okay. So rather than go back to E minor, we've got a major chord. And that takes us into Let's Get Busy. Wanna get physical? Let's get in the physical. Let me hear your body talk. Your body talk. Let me hear your body talk. Let's get physical. Physical. I wanna get physical. Let's get in the physical. Let me hear your body talk. Your body talk, let me hear your body talk. 
So, uh, really simple for the chorus, just a C major 7 for 4 bars, then up to an E minor. And if you want to, you can throw in a little, throw in a few of those D um, with an E in the bass, just to funk it up a little bit. you want to do uh, you can have fun with that on the chorus and the guitar solo which is played by the great Stevie Lukather is played over the chorus chords so we'll take a look at that right now <laughs> Great little solo there from Stevie Lukather, and uh, let's break it down. So we start with this nice uh, run up the G, uh, the E minor scale, or G major, but we're kind of thinking E minor here. So I start with D to E, 5 to 7. And then I go G to A, with a couple of little slides. So 5, 7, 5, 7, then slide to 9. Then the D on seven, so five, seven, five, seven, nine, seven. Then I slide all the way up to fourteen, and then play a G and hold that on twelve. Then I've got. So what I'm playing next is a bend from A to B, then releasing to A, so 14 bending to 16, release to 14, the G, then a trill, F sharp to G, and F sharp again, so 11, 12, 11, slide down to E on 7, on 9 sorry, then D on 7, finish on E on 9. So slowly from the start. So I'll do again. Then the next one up is we, we slide to a B on 14. So, then we got D, E on 12, 14, and then F sharp, then G on, so we got 14 on A, 12, 14 on D, F sharp on G, 11, G on uh, uh, 12, A on 14, B on 12, then D on 15, B on 12, back to D. Nice. Then we've got a bend from that. Bend it up to E. So bending 15 to 17. And he puts plenty of vibrato on that. And then releasing back to to 15, the, the D. Then we've got a bend from uh, a B to D, then a bend from A to B. Uh, so, sorry, B to D, 
then bend from A to B. Release to A. And then I bend from F sharp. Just a, a semitone up to G. Then pick a D on the 10th fret of the top string. So we're skipping a string. Then I slide from the F sharp here to A on 14 and land on an E on 12 on the D string. So nice little lick. So 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 I'll play that little bun. I'll play it better. Nice little phrase there. And then after we've got we've got this. Uh, so a B is like a pedal note. So B and F sharp. So B on 12 with the B string, F sharp 14 on the E string. Then B again and G on 15. Then repeat. And then we slide up to a, a D on 15, A, G. So 15, 17, 15, 15. And play. So we play. So we, we do that. Then we bend uh, up to a B. Pick that twice. And then release. So release back to A. G on 15. F sharp on 14. Back to G. A and G. A, G, and then the bend again. And then this time we go down the scale. So bending from B, releasing to A, G, F sharp, then down to E on 17, D on 15, and back to E. And then we've got um, a series of minor third bends. So I'm bending up to a G note from E. So bending, um, not a, uh, a major second, um, but pushing it an extra semitone to a minor third. Classic Stevie Lukather there. So bending E up to G, re-picking that. Releasing. Pulling off to D. Play the B. So pulling off to 15. B on 16 on G string, finishing on E on 17. And then this next lick is a classic bit of Stevie Lukather also. Uh, you'll hear it in like Rosanna. I bend uh, a major second up to from E to F sharp. So, so I'm so I bend and then add my little finger on top. So I'm playing, so I get those notes. Cause I'm picking an already bent note. I'm fretting uh, uh, an extra fret above it. It's already bent. So um, bending up to F sharp and fretting one more gives me that F sharp to G. Then release. Pull off to D, play a B, on 16, then D, E, D, 17, 15, 17, 
15. And then finish. I'm playing a little. And it's hard to hear just how he finishes this. It seems to sort of fade out as the vocals come back in. Uh, but uh, I'm playing D, uh, B to D, A. So 12, 15, 12, 14, 12. Then I'm playing G, sliding down to F. Sliding down to F, E, D, and just letting that slide out. So, yeah. That's the kind of... And, and it's a great solo. I've forgotten what a good song uh, this was. So thanks for recommending it and uh, happy playing. Thank you.